for our next player. Because this is an aircraft that can fill the accuracy. I'm sure the vast majority of you will not have seen this before. An extremely impressive machine, an impressive demonstration of the capabilities of Japan's extremely experienced aviation industry. Because this is a Japanese built aircraft with Japanese engines and Japanese systems. It's also the first time that in the UK we've ever seen a flying display of a Japanese military aircraft. It comes to us from the Japanese Maritime Self-Defense Force and rolling now is the Kawasaki V1. very smartly into the air. As you can see, this four jet maritime patrol aircraft. Of course, Japan is a country with a great need for such a machine in its infantry, given the extent of its territorial waters and the number of Japanese island territories. The V-1, developed by Kawasaki, is a replacement for the Japanese Maritime Self-Defense Forces fleet of Lockheed P-3C, <coughs> or Ryan, from the prototype of XP-1, then it's made in flight in September 2007. We saw you climbing out there at a speed of 135 miles. Currently, he has around 6,100 flying hours. It's a very versatile aircraft. The V-1 is off multi mission mode, able to cover a wide speed and indeed altitude envelope. And particularly notable is the fact that it's the first production aircraft in the world to use very sophisticated fly-by-light technology for its flying control. That's in an effort to reduce potential electromagnetic interference. The next part coming up is around 155 knots and we'll see the electro-optical and infrared turret extended and the weapons bay doors on the underside will be open. Very easy chance to see into this aircraft for bay. Something very impressive about this aeroplane is how quiet it is. The 
Queen's main entrance for IHI XF7-19 and £13,500 of front. Ha, ha, ha. 